Republicans now formally making their case in an impeachment inquiry against President Biden. The allegations include suspicious business deals that the president and his son Hunter may have participated in, though so far no evidence has been presented. Our D.C. Bureau Chief Ben Kennedy is live in Washington with more on today's hearing. Ben. Nicole and Louie Republicans say they will look at more than two dozen pieces of evidence. Democrats call this a waste of time as President Biden denies he did anything wrong. Today, the House Oversight Committee will examine claims that President Joe Biden engaged in corruption during his time as VP as House Republicans held their first impeachment inquiry hearing Thursday. Joe Biden abused his public office for his family's financial gain. The investigation centers on alleged high crimes, implicating the commander in chief and his son Hunter's foreign business dealings. Hunter Biden cashed in by arranging access to Joe Biden. Just this week, we uncovered two additional wires sent to Hunter Biden that originated in Beijing from Chinese nationals. This happened when Joe Biden was running for president of the United States and Joe Biden's home is listed as the beneficiary address. His remarks come amid testimony from four witnesses, one pointing out to the panel a lack of evidence in the case. I do not believe that the current evidence would support articles of impeachment. That is something that an inquiry has to establish. What does Professor Turley say? It says everything we know at this juncture doesn't rise to the level of impeachment. Boy, that is awkward. The White House calls the impeachment inquiry extreme politics at its worst. Democrats say it is merely a distraction from the looming government shutdown. Reporting live in Washington, D.C., Ben Kennedy, Local 10 News. Ben